Hey, hey, how's it going? If you're new here, my name is Jam and I love makeup. And if you're not new, thanks for coming back. I really appreciate you. So this isn't gonna be like a makeup video. In fact, there's very few beauty things in here, but I'm seeing all the cool kids on the YouTubes doing, you know, Amazon hauls and the best at Amazon and literally nothing they haul really speaks to me. I mean, sunglasses, absolutely. I have a bit of an addiction to sunglasses and you know, I'm okay with that. It's not an expensive addiction. I get everything off the Zon, so it's pretty cheap. So I would recommend Amazon for sunglasses, but this isn't gonna be about that. This is gonna be the things that like have actually had an impact on my life. I'm not gonna say it changed my life for the better, blah, blah, blah. But seriously, some of these things have definitely changed pieces of my life. So if you wanna see all of my thoughts on the things you can get on the Zon, stick around, we're gonna get into it. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, now is a great time to do that. I upload several videos every week. If you click on the little bell and choose all, YouTube will notify you when I upload a new one. And then you can watch it or not, totally up to you, no pressure. Either way, I appreciate you hanging out with me. As for this look, I don't know if the video is up yet. I just filmed it and I haven't even looked at the footage yet. So if it's good, it'll be up soon if it's not already. And if it's bad, it'll never see the light of day. So there's that. I'm going to insert photos of all of the things that I'm talking about and I will definitely link to everything I can either in the description box or in a pinned comment. My description box has a little bit of stuff in it. The first thing are these headphones or earbuds or whatever you want to call them. I bought a pair and used them and used them and used them and used them. They charge really fast. They last a long time. I usually only wear one because I need to hear what's going on around me. Just because you're paranoid doesn't mean they're not out to get you. Um, but these are excellent. And then I dropped them in the potty and though they are waterproof and it, it did survive, I could hear it in the potty. Whenever I listened to a video, it was playing, or not in the potty rather, in the garbage, like it was playing. Um, but I wasn't about to touch it or put it back in my ear once it was in the potty. So I would, Definitely recommend these if you're on the hunt for a really good pair of earbuds. They are not expensive. Love, love, love them. If you're looking for earbuds, highly recommend. These next two I'm gonna put up together are hair ties. I had seen someone and I wish I could remember who it was. It's gone forever, it's never coming back. But these nylon hair ties are amazing. I got the black ones for me and Mike. Mike has really long hair. He's home today, maybe he'll make an appearance, maybe he'll behave himself and stay out there. I don't know. <laughs> he can't be bossed, so it's up to him. Um, but the black ones are really, really good. They don't hurt my head, they stay in, they're lovely. And the little like blonde ones, I got the tiny ones for our one-year-old granddaughter because you know, one-year-olds don't have a lot of hair, but it's growing and it gets in her eyes. So we just pin up like the very top part and it's so cute. And she's got that whole little pebbles thing going and it's adorable. Anyway, they go in easy, they come out easy, they stay, they're lovely. This next thing is kind of beauty. It's the brow dye that I just got and though I've only used it once, I love it. It is so, so, so good. This one specifically, because you can adjust how much black or brown you want in it, because it comes with both. It's so good. It went in nicely and it lasted probably a solid three weeks, which is better than the beard one I had before. I, I have a couple gray hairs in my brows. <laughs> I should rip them out, but I don't really care, I suppose. Today I do a little bit, because I'm like menopausing and you know, kind of thinking about the way things could have been differently. You know, just, I'm having a moment. So instead of wallowing, I'm chatting with you. This next one are, it's little puffs that I get off the Zon. They work fantastic for pressing on powder. They're really nice for it, even like concealer under your eyes. They're great for all the things. I always use these to press on the Danessa Myricks Yummy Skin Powder Balm thingy. They're fantastic. They wash pretty well. They don't last forever. You know, the seam comes undone and you know, a couple of stitches and you'd be good to go. Like they'd be like brand new, but I do recommend these. I like them a lot. The most important part of these 
is the bigger ones, when I wash them, the inside part kind of like chunks up a little bit. And I've been able to fix them, but this last time could not get it fixed for anything. These don't do that. Oh, oh I'm being attacked from my hair. I have my ceiling fan going because again, menopausing. Um, these ones don't get deformed in the washer or the dryer. They just stay the way they're supposed to. And I really like that. So definitely recommend those. This next thing is only if you, it's very specific. These are cork boards. And I thought they were really cute because you could arrange them any kind of way you want to on the wall. For my birthday, my bestest bestie in the whole world made me a jar full of little sayings and affirmations. And so I decided I wanted to put them on the wall so I could see them and not just read them once. So I'll insert a picture of them here so you can see what it looks like on my wall with my little notes on them. But it's very, very cool. One for every day, almost for a year. So that's been a lot of fun. And then you can use it for whatever you want. And they're really cool. They're like, you know, they're not just that big, huge cork board thing that's not very cute. These are nice. I like them a lot. And these are the little uh, push pins I got to go with it. I just, they were so cute. And I really like the natural wood thing with black. You couldn't tell from my background. It's, my living room is all wood and black as well. It's just kind of what I like. And who doesn't love an itty bitty clothespin? I mean, that's amazing, right? And you can use it as a clothespin or you can use it as a push pin, which I thought was so cute. So I definitely like these so much. <sighs> this next one. It's a blanket. Holy moly. Love, love, love this blanket. It's warm without being too warm. Mike can use it without sweating his butt off. I definitely need to because I'm cold, but this is amazing. The weight is beautiful. It's super cozy, really affordable, washes very easily in the washing machine, dries in the dryer, super easy, lovely. The one thing I would say is we have a queen size bed and got the queen size blanket or full, whichever one they offered. And it wasn't quite big enough. So if you have a full size bed or a queen size bed and there's one of you or you like to really snuggle in with your blankie, get a king size. We ended up getting a second one in the king size and that's perfect. I gave the, um, the slightly smaller one to my sister so she really liked it too. So now <laughs> we both have one. Usually if I like something, I'm buying it for her too because she has to love it like I do. That's just them's the rules. When you love something, you give it to somebody else so they can love it too. This next one, again, not for everybody, but I've been through several different hair straighteners and they've all been fine. Like they mostly do the job, no big. This one is flipping amazing. I was so shocked when I used it the first time. I have coarse, thick, curly hair. And I usually have to go through over and over and over and over, which is really not good for your hair. With this, I just can go through once, maybe twice, like in the back where it's really, really curly. No more curls. It slides right through. It doesn't do that weird creasing thing. It doesn't get caught on my hair. It's lovely. And again, not very expensive. And I only use it at 355, which is amazing to me. I mean, most of the time I have to crank it up to 375 or 400, which is so bad. I try to be careful with my hair because maybe I don't want to ruin it. This next thing has some swear words, which isn't gonna be for everybody. I personally enjoy a good swear word here and there. And this planner has been amazing for me. This is the second one I've purchased for myself. And it's one of those things where I bought one for my sister and then we bought one for all of like her neighborhood friends. Like everybody needed this planner. I love it so much. It helps me stay organized. It helps me see what I've accomplished, what I want to accomplish. And I write a lot of stuff in the notes section of my phone, which I could never not do. But the planner just helps a little bit more in a different way. Plus the little affirmations in there are hilarious. Like they're just a good time. So I would definitely recommend this. And I love that it's spiral round so I can open it all the way up, fold it over and like set it in my lap and write and do whatever I'm gonna do. And then I can close it up. It's got an elastic to save the page and my hair keeps attacking me because I have the ceiling fan on. Ah. This next thing is a power bank. I've been through several different kinds of power banks. This one is the bee's knees. It is the best power bank I have ever used. One charge gets me 
five days of charging my phone because I, I usually keep my phone on me um, mostly for safety reasons if something should happen I have it in my lap um, but the power bank lasts forever. I took it on the cruise. I was able to charge my phone, all the things we needed to charge from the power bank and then charge it overnight. And you've got another five days worth of charge left in it. I let my friend borrow one cause she lost power for a long time. And then she decided that they needed one as well. So I definitely recommend this power bank. It's fantastic. And the last time I checked, it was really, really cheap. I think the first time I got it, I paid like $60 for it. And now this last purchase I made was 36. So that's pretty darn good. This one is probably my favorite. It's my iron flask water bottle. I bought one for all of the grandbabies, Dallas, Mike, like we all have iron flask. Nope, yeah, iron flask. My friend Jesse had gotten me and Jackson a hydro flask, which was amazing. Lasted a long time, loved it. But then something happened with mine. I don't know if it was the paint chipping or what, but it stopped keeping my water cold. And I like ice cold water, like with ice, ice cold water. In this flipping water bottle, the iron flask is more affordable than hydro flask and works just as well, if not better. Like you couldn't tell the difference. So if you like really cold beverages, definitely check out the iron flask. They are amazing. Oh, here's the little bamboo, like Lazy Susan type thingy that I keep on my desk. It's so good. It spins really smooth. It's bamboo, so it's natural wood, looks nice, holds a ton of stuff. Like, I'll insert a picture here of what mine's holding. It's, it's so good. Definitely would recommend this for like organization type stuff. Speaking of organization, this next one, again, not for everybody, but I have had so many different kinds of organization for wrapping paper, holiday paper, gift bags, you know, all the things that you need to wrap a present. In this wrapping paper bag or whatever you wanna call it, has structured sides so it doesn't collapse. It's got spots for literally everything. It is amazing. Uh, my friend Marissa came over and helped me wrap Christmas presents. And when she saw it, she was like, oh my gosh, like literally squeeing because it's such a good thing you don't know you need until you have it. So I had to go on the Zon and order her one. And when she got it, she said she moved right into it. She was so excited. I didn't tell her I was doing it. I just did it because she was gonna get one, you know, after the holidays and all of that. Nay, nay, I got you, boo. <laughs> this one is so pretty. I, silverware has been a huge thing for me. When my kids were little, I don't know why, but they ended up throwing away a lot of silverware on accident. Like, how does that happen? I don't know if it's like cleaning off their dishes and the garbage and then the silverware just falls in and they don't care. So once they, I had always said when they moved out, I was buying myself some really nice silverware since it wouldn't be thrown away, I would be able to have it forever. And I did, and I loved it. And then, um, I was on the hunt for yogurt spoons, which is really actually a Sunday spoon, like the ones you get like in a restaurant, they're really long handled ones. Jackson eats um, a specific yogurt and it only comes in a big tub and nobody's got time to scoop it out into a bowl, use a regular fork or spoon. So I found these Sunday spoons for him and we call them yogurt spoons and they're beautiful. They're black, they're, they're so nice. And I was like, wait a minute, there's black silverware. So I found these ones and oh my gosh, I love them. They're really, really nice quality. When we first got them, Mike opened it and was like, eee, these look like they might be sharp. Um, I have a thing about silverware. If it's got any kind of sharp edges, I can't touch it. And it looked like it might, but they don't. They're very soft, really, really nice. We've had them for several months now and they're holding up really well. They're amazing. Sticking with kitchen gadgets, this immersion blender is not mine. I got it for my sister and we were just talking about it the other day and she said it's amazing. She said she uses it almost every day for everything. She cannot believe she waited so long to get one. She asks her all the time for things that she would like to have. And you know, definitely Christmas, her birthday, all the things. And she never mentioned this one though. It's been on her list for two years. So, 
when I found out she wanted one. I got her one and she says it's amazing. This one specifically she loves. So if you're looking for an immersion blender, this one's got really good reviews from someone I actually know. This next thing is bamboo paper towels. We don't buy paper towels or paper plates or any of that stuff, but these bamboo paper towels are washable. And so I get a roll of these and it lasts so long because you can use it, chuck it in the washer, chuck it in the dryer, fold it up, put it in the linen closet, use it again over and over and over and over. Do. Next we have the world's best pillow. I'm not exaggerating, it is the world's best pillow ever, ever, ever. It's the Coop pillow. I think that's the name. We called it co-op for a while, but I think it's actually Coop. It's amazing, it's fully adjustable. You stuff it into the dryer once a week, once every two weeks, re-fluff it. You can add more fluff to it, take fluff out. It is literally the perfect pillow. If you don't love yours, go get this one. I'm not even kidding. If you don't have one, I would definitely recommend the A-L-E-X-A or the Echo Dot. I don't know what you call yours if you have one, so I'm trying to be careful. I love mine. I set reminders on it. I play music on it. Literally every single day, it helps me with something. And now when there's a shipment coming, she says it in a way that's like super exciting. Like a shipment will arrive today. <laughs> so fun. This one is a book written by my stepsister. Highly recommend. Some of it's funny, some of it's not so funny. She has a second one too. But it's called Crazy Like Mine and I highly recommend it. If I can find it, I'll link it. Oh, man, that one's not a biography. It's not a happy feel good book, oh, but it's a good book. And my stepsister is amazing. Uh, real quick, just like the e.l.f. cleansing cloud. Love, love, love these for makeup removal, for washing my face. They're fantastic. If you have littles and need a freeze pop mold, these are the best that I've found, aside from one of the ones that are no longer available. I make all of the kids freeze pops in the summertime. I just use Propel and, you know, spring water, and that way they get some electrolytes and get to have freeze pops without all the sugar and the yuck. So, speaking of buggies, ooh, we have ticks here in Vermont. I don't know if you have them where you live, but Mike works outside. He gets ticks all the time. This tick tornado, uh, my friend Jess gave me, and it's amazing for getting ticks out because it doesn't, it just like slides on them and you twist it and then the tick just comes out. So definitely recommend these if you're looking for tick removal. Next, we have my favorite hairbrush ever. Love, love, love this. It's so good, it doesn't hurt, and I have the world's most sensitive scalp. I'm not exaggerating. I really, really do. It's awful. Love this hairbrush so, so, so much. Mike tried it, loved it, needed one for his own self, so yeah. And I highly recommend this, like, shower shampoo brush. I use one, Jackson uses one, Mike uses one, like, my sisters, the kids, like, I. I've given these or introduced these to pretty much everybody I know. They are fantastic for your scalp, for when you're washing your hair. Absolutely lovely. And that is everything. <laughs> I know, it's so not a cool kid haul, but all of these things are really, really good. So let me know. I know Amazon isn't the best place for purchasing things, but if you're if you have a hard time finding things or you have a hard time going out into the world or you know you just you need an easy way to get some stuff i i do use amazon for that as well as like the subscribe and save cat food potty paper the things we use on the reg i just have it subscribe and save you save some money it comes at the same time whatever you set up it works out really well i like it a lot and if you made it this far i super appreciate you and i'm doing a giveaway i got sent the nine pan nomad orient express palette and i have the big one so i don't need it so i'm gonna give it away if you want to enter just leave a comment down below telling me if you know let's see what can we do just use the word amazon easy i don't want it to be complicated i'm gonna leave it open until saturday I'll leave it open till Saturday and then I'll pick a winner and I will ship it out. I think it has to be in the US. Shipping is so hard to do. 
but it's actually here in my hot little hands. So it won't be coming from a brand, so it makes it a bit trickier. But anyway, yeah, we'll just do a random giveaway. I really appreciate hanging out with me today. Hopefully you like this. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Either way, I appreciate you. Be good and remember to be kind to you.